Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is Tanisha with Pampered Pretty Pleasures. Today I have a very exciting video because I finally get to do the what's in my bag video. So I wanted to premiere this bag out of all the bags that I did just recently get because I've been having so much fun um, using this bag. And even though Easter is over, um, this is the week of Easter, it's Sunday. Um, I know Easter is last Sunday, but I just want to show you all of the things that I had in my bag the week prior to Easter and the week of Easter, um, post Easter, because this is real life and I just want to show you what was in this bag. This bag has been a great carry. It's been a great catch all. And I hosted my first annual Easter egg hunt with around, I invited around 50 people. Um, we had around, I think, close to 20 kids who were in attendance. So I do have some extra leftovers of things that um, we have from the Easter egg hunt. Um, the reason why these ears are in here, because these technically were left over in my bag, along with the little extra treats. And this is why this is the What's in My Bag Easter edition, because this is literally what was in my bag for real. So um, yeah, these are some little extra treats that we had. I had some treat bags um, with candies attached to these little things. Let me just show you what was in here. It was a pencil, some bubbles, and oops, an Easter stamp. And let me make sure I'm in frame because I'm sitting weird. Okay, so all of this stuff pretty much was in my bag. Do I carry this stuff all day, every day? No, but was it in my bag when I was preparing? Yes, it was. <laughs> so um, the reason why these are here because these are the little baskets that we gave all the kids for the Easter egg kind. We had pink for the girls, blue for the boys, and these are just the leftovers that we had. So I'm just gonna put this in there for now. I would say grab a cup of coffee or your favorite drink. I have mine, it's gonna be a long video. I am drinking a iced caramel macchiato that I made from home. And if you're wondering about this cup, I got this from the 99 cent store years ago. And it is so pretty, I love it. I should have got an extra one, but it has the gold detail and it hasn't messed up or anything. Um, but it says hello spring on it. And because it's the springtime, I decided to use my cup to go with the thing. So anywho, pause the video, go get your favorite snack or drink, and join me on this ride of <laughs> what's in my bag. Now, here's a disclosure. This bag is super heavy, and I um, just wanna like tilt it. Let me see if you guys can see that. Just tilt it to see um, what's in my bag. So far, so um, I haven't explained this um, in this video, but this is my Coach City Totes, and this is the cherry print, cherry signature print. Um, this tag did come with the bag, and the cherry here, this came from Amazon, I think it was $7.99, but it just goes perfectly with this bag. I've gotten so many compliments using this bag so far. So. This right now, full disclosure, is my like mommy bag slash carry all for the Easter week. So that's why it's full. I do not have all the stuff in my bag always, but this is what has literally legit been in my bag. Okay, so I have a pouch here. I know this does not go with a the cherry theme, but these peaches, I swear, look like cherries to me. And I know I have a very small channel, but Coach, if you're listening, please, 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 please come out with the peach collection. Now, I am new to Coach in a while. I had Coach in the past, but I didn't get on to the coach trends until recently when I've been going crazy over watching these what's in my bag videos. So I am late on the train and I'm glad I got in when I did because I would have been so upset if I would have missed this cherry print. I was only able to get a couple of things from the cherry collection, um, but 
I'm glad I was able to at least get the back. So anywho, <laughs> I got this peach pouch from the Dollar Tree. And this is a pencil pouch and in my pencil pouch right now, I do have some pen pencils and these are the paper mate pencils. I love these mechanical pencils so much. Um, I do have a Sharpie in there and I do have a pen that I think, I, yeah, I got this from the Dollar Tree. It's so pretty. Love that so much. Okay, um, this clipboard, this does not always stay in my bag, but I got this clipboard from the Dollar Tree last year during the back to school session, and I did use this for the Easter egg kind. It was so convenient to have this in my bag because I was able to use this as a checklist, and I really felt like an event planner slash coordinator, but yeah, I had this in the bag. Let's see, I'm going to put it down here. I have my receipt pouch. This is one of my receipt pouches. Even though it says with the doll here, um, I usually use this pouch to withdraw cash from the bank. Um, but I have some receipts in here from the event, so I definitely need to file those away. Oops, one second. Okay, I'm back. Um, I forgot to mention <laughs> this umbrella. I finally got the umbrella. I think I showed it in a coach haul, but I can't wait to put this umbrella in this bag. I did not have this umbrella in this bag, but I definitely wanted to show it to you all to see how cute it looks. I'm going to put it in the bag though when I'm done dumping it out because I'm supposed to be going to the county fair today with my family and I know it's gonna be hot out there. So I'm definitely going to use this as a form of protection. Okay, let's see. Here are my car keys. I got this um, Michael Kors car key case from Poshmark. It has my house key, my PO box keys. It has a gym card. It has another space for cards. And it is so convenient. I do have my gym key, no, my gym key, my car key. And I have a hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works years ago. I just refill it every time. This came from Walmart and it did come up with a gold wallet as well, but I did take it off because I wanted to use this Michael Kors key case. And I have my keychain from Amazon and I have this lip gloss that surprisingly is not bad and I got this from the Dollar Tree so cute definitely goes with my spring theme okay let's go back here okay here's my new coach um, notebook I don't exactly know exactly what I'm going to use it for, um, but I love it so much. It has, uh-oh, my little things came off, but I have these cute little paper clips. I got this from Timu, so I got this one from Timu as well, I believe, and so um, is this. This is from Timu as well. I believe this is in my Timu um shopping haul. So right now I'm still trying to decorate the notebook, uh -oh. but um, I'm definitely using it as obviously a catch-all. And I did start um, my Easter plans with this. So I've been using this for like pretty much events so far. So I guess it's fitting because it's going with the Easter theme right now. But I love this notebook so much. And the pin that I just showed you goes perfectly with this set. So cute. Okay. One of my stepdaughters, well, both of my stepdaughters actually has received a Easter card from one of their aunts who couldn't make it to the party. So um, the other one has hers already. 
and of course I have to hold all their stuff so this was in my bag so I definitely need to give this to my stepdaughter so she can eat her candy and enjoy her card I thought that was just the cutest little Easter card ever so cute okay so I have a um, an Erin Condren planner this is not my real planner but I did pick this up from the Dollar Tree I thought it was perfect for the spring and right now I'm just using it as a temporary planner so when I come from out and about and I need to jot things down I write it in here and then I transfer it onto my original paper planner that I have at home I also have like my passwords and stuff like that in here as well and so it's definitely convenient and again I picked this up from the Dollar Tree and it's so cute Okay, so here is my um, agenda, and I switch it out from using it as a baby planner and a wallet, but I mainly use this as a wallet. I've been using agendas as wallets for literally years, like a long, for a long time. So um, in here, just have some cards, some cash, and I do have my cash categorized. Um, I have groceries, gas, house, beauty, treats, spending, and coins. And I love this agenda so much because it does have extra slots to put receipts or cash in. There's a pin loop and there's another space in the front too. So I love this one, especially when I have my mini bags. I use this one um, for my mini bags. Now, I do have a larger one this is like my taking care of business wallet I love it so so much she's fat and chunky and I got this cute little um, keychain from so crafty by Sana I'll try to link her um, website below but she has the cutest charms ever and let me just give you a tour of the charms if you're interested Here's a Dior chain, a Chanel Visa credit card. I love Visa and Chanel. I have a rose because I am from Pasadena, the city of roses. I do have a butterfly. I have a Chanel coin purse, so cute. I have a pink key, this little money sign. <laughs> With the hands a lollipop not a lollipop a popsicle a starbucks drink cup adorable a love sign with pearls i have adidas and my favorite chanel so love this so much oh and up here this a gucci um little keychain i got this idea from pink sparkly chick hey girl hey um i think she decorated somebody's platter like this and she put this on top and it was just so cute and i was like oh my god i had to steal that idea and it's funny because i already had this already that i was um i was going to put in a gift package but i ended up stealing it from that gift package and putting it on my planner not my planner my wallet um, I'm not going to really show you what's in here because it is a hot mess, but um, this is my catch, not my catch on, this is my main true wallet. I have a lot of credit cards and a lot of debit cards and I like to categorize my cash. So the reason why this baby is out because I call this my taking care of business wallet and I went to the bank to go get cash out um, of the bank for the Easter egg hunt. So um, let me just show you really quick my cash breakdown slips i do have these cash breakdown slips in my etsy shop which i'll be sure to post below um but i have um these cash breakdown slips i use them for the teller to get different denominations for the easter egg hunt and i did get like a lot of two dollar bills i got some five dollar bills and some singles and so i did put different denominations in the um, easter egg hunt in the Easter eggs for the hunt so um, yeah um, so I pretty much have stamps in here credit cards debit cards um, business cards coupons receipts I have everything and speaking of coupons I do have a Bath and Body Works coupon that I definitely need to spend 
and I it has the same setup as the other one um, where there's a space for cards a pin loop and a yeah an extra slip in the um, slip in the front for extra cash so I love this thing so much it's not pretty right now so I don't want to show her off then maybe I'll do a separate video of what it really looks like when it's not in chaos <laughs> but I love it so much she's so cute okay here's a new item that I did get from Poshmark and I showed that in the haul but it's so cute it's my little cherry sidekick it has a tea charm on it and the original cherry charm as well and right now I'm just using this as a catch-all there's some extra cash my husband gave me I need to put that away some extra receipts some cards and stuff like that that's all what's in there oh my god I love this thing so so much it's so freaking cute and I love pulling her out of this bag it's it's just the cutest okay here's my bathroom pouch I'm not going to show everything in here but you know all the stuff a woman needs on that time of the month I have some extra tissue sorry I have some extra tissues in there um, I do have some extra wipes and stuff like that so that's pretty much that's all in that bathroom pouch right now and I got this from the Dollar Tree and it is literally adorable I love how it feels too okay so I do have my sunglasses case that I showed in a haul the case I showed in the haul but not the glasses these are like my favorite pair of glasses right now that I picked up from downtown LA after our honeymoon so cute I love those glasses and speaking of honeymoon this week is my one year anniversary so I'm super excited about that okay so here this is a pencil pouch but I'm currently using it as a tech pouch and in here I do have my um, AirPods and I have another set which is a lavender in the car for the gym so I have those I have a charger to the AirPods I have my backup earbuds just in case my AirPods die on me and I have this selfie light in here that I showed in a haul but I didn't show it outside the packaging so it has three light settings and you just clip it on your phone and um, pretty much use it as a selfie light you also can use this now that I think about it as a purse um, light too so it could be a two-for-one if you need to save room in your bag and speaking of phone I'm recording on my phone right now which I have a Samsung Galaxy S22 this is the case to it it is dirty I need to get another one but I got it from Amazon but I love it because it does stick out and I can just literally lay it down to rest but you just put this on your phone like this and you just use it as a selfie light how cool is that and I think they had different colors too uh, I think they had a great one but of course I got pink because that's my favorite color let me get some coffee because this video is already getting so long okay so this is what the bag is looking like so far let me get some coffee mmm so good okay so what's in here oh okay so I got this pencil case from the back to school event last year from um, the Dollar Tree it is the peaches now this is a pencil case I'm not using it as a pencil case but I got this great idea from one of the um, girls in the purse community she got a slender case similar to this but it was clear from either Timu or Shein I forgot but she's using it to hold her snacks in so her granola bars don't get crushed. And I was like, that is a really great idea. And I was about to go look online, but I really, I discovered that I had this case. And I have the rainbow one, I have the avocado one, and I have this one. So, um, of course, I, I stuck with the theme with the peaches for 
the other thing I had, the pencil case that I had, but let me just stop talking and show you. So right now I do have some candy in there. I do have two Nutrigrain um, bars and I have some pepper, a peppermint and I have two strawberry, two starburst um, in each pack. So I have two of those and just to give you a reference as to what it can fit in here. So you can hold at least two Nutrigrain bars or any um, power bar or anything like that um, in this case. So I thought that was genius. I cannot remember her name, but oh my God, I'm so glad she came up with that idea because it is genius. Who wants a flat Nutrigrain bar in their bag? I don't, but this is a great way to store some snacks and candies in your bag. It is a hard tin case, so it's definitely not going to smush at all. So I love that so much. That is a great tip for you to put in your bag. And those granola bars are for me, are for the girls if they get hungry or they want like a little snack and we're on the go. And speaking of the girls, um, this is something new I started to curate in my bags. These are um, pretty much their like pack and play pouches. Again, they are six and eight. They don't really require toys or anything like that. They do have cell phones and um, a tablet. Um, please don't get on me about the cell phones. That was not my idea. But um, <laughs> nonetheless, they have them. So if I need to like keep their cell phones or their chargers to their cell phones, they'll have their own individual pouches. And these pouches I did get from the Dollar Tree. They are so cute along with the charms as well. This one has a purple unicorn with a rainbow. And this one has a pink unicorn with a rainbow. And um, these were in my bag because we went to um, some restaurants this week. And you know how kids get anxious and, you know, they always want to do something. And we don't really encourage phones at the table. So I just took out my um, pouches for them and gave them to them so that they can have things to do. Now, I got this. Um, notepad from the Dollar Tree, of course, Easter themed. So they have this with some crayons and a pen that I also got from the Dollar Tree as well. It's super cute and I love it. So one girl likes teal, the other one likes pink. That's why all her stuff coordinates. The other one has the same exact thing. So, but she just has a different notepad, different set of crayons, and she actually has the pink one. And these are those pens that you can actually change the colors of the ink. So I love that. Oops, so much. Did I just drop that? Okay, let's see. I have this emergency pouch, and in this pouch, I do have some nail glue a hair tie, a chapstick, some clear nail polish, more glue, and some extra stuff that I came with, deodorant, um, nail polish remover, stain remover, and deodorant. And there's some coins and bobby pins at the bottom. And I love this thing so much. It is so cute. I even keep emergency cash in here sometimes too. I have a lotion that I got from Victoria's Secret Outlet. And this is the um, scent grapefruit. And let's see what else is in here. I have my cosmetic bag that I showed in the coach haul. I love this thing so much, and I got this lip gloss from the Dollar Tree for the Valentine's Day season. I have a Milani lip gloss, and I think this is Tropical Shine. So cute. Um, I'm just dropping everything. I have a Seraphine um Hermeson Plump Lip Gloss. I have a Better Than You See That Word. Mascara from Too Faced. 
Um, I have some earrings that I got from Timu. I always keep some extra earrings in my bag just in case because I do not like to leave the house without earrings. I do have a mirror that I got from Timu. I showed that in a haul recently. I have a Too Faced Damn Girl Mascara that I got from my BoxyCharm. I have a um, lip gloss from, a, no, a lipstick from Milani. And this color is Pleasure, and I love the name. It's like meant for me, Pamper Pretty Pleasures. But I love that lipstick so much. It's the perfect nude for me. Love it. And I do have a rose lip balm from Vaseline. And I have a bobby pin. Uh oh. And I also have the Coco Bold from Too Faced. And this color is buttercream. This is also a perfect nude for me as well. Mm, and it smells like chocolate. So I love this. I'm going to collect all of the colors eventually, but they're like $28 a pop. So yeah, in due time. We'll take our time with that. No rush. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put all this stuff back into my little cosmetic bag. I mainly do my makeup at my vanity at home, but these are the things I take on the go with me to touch up if I need to touch up. And let's see what else is in here. We're getting, we're getting there, guys. I do have a nail set. Love that. I also have my coin pouch, which is the Louis Vuitton Inspire key clay. And I just keep some coins in there. I have a new coin pouch I'm going to start using, but this is what I have in there so far. And let's see, I think we're empty over here. So the last pocket I have is some Barbie tissues. I love these things. I got them from the Dollar Tree. Um, I do have some Aqua Rail um, wet wipes. And the last, no, and uh, one more thing. And I have a first aid kit that I got from the Dollar Tree. And I put some extras in there, but it came with the scissors, the tweezers, the safety pin, this little knife set, and then I added the antiseptic towelettes, the first aid burn cream, the antibiotic ointment, hand sanitizer, um, antibacterial antiseptic pad and some band-aids so I love this because it's so cute and compact the girls have been like having owies and just having all kinds of accidents recently since we've been out and about so this has definitely come in handy lately so I have that and then the last thing I have is that famous flashlight that all the girls have in the what's in my bag videos and it's so convenient and I got the pink one and I got that from the Dollar Tree so and then I have my purse organizer it does have a um, attachment to it that I did not keep in here for now because my bag was already heavy oh and then this was the little paper clip that fell off of my notepad so yeah, that was all what was in my bag. It's been a great carry. I love this bag so much. I literally get a lot of compliments from this bag. It is so durable. I've been very rough with the bag and shockingly, she's still intact so far. I know I just got her, but I'm definitely going to keep up with her because she is just a gem. The girls love her so much they talk to her all the time they're like oh hi miss sherry so i'm definitely gonna possibly give this to one of the girls um later on if they do decide to want this bag years to come but for now she is all mine um but yeah she's really good to like carry around when you're like out and about and you're shopping and you have to hold everyone's things and 
people come to you and ask you, do you have all of these random things? So this is a great carry for that. I love all of the city totes, well not all of them, but I just love the city tote line. I hope they never discontinue this bag because it's definitely a staple for me. And so I'm gonna stop rambling, but I just wanna say thank you all so much for watching my my what's in my bag video. These videos are so fun to me. Like I just wanna like encourage you to like keep it fun, make your bags like personal to you. You don't have to carry as many things as I do in my bags, but I love to, um, I'm a holiday person. I love to stay on theme. So I started doing that recently. So my what's in my bag videos, they may be themed or they may not, we don't know. But right now I have to pack her up again because we're going to the county fair and I'm definitely taking this baby to the county fair with my umbrella it's gonna be so cute with my umbrella yeah i'm gonna definitely take my umbrella to the county fair i'm definitely taking miss cherry's sidekick to the county fair and we're just gonna have a jolly good time this spring season so again i hope you all enjoyed the video you guys have a beautiful blessed day stay pampered stay pretty and always maintain pleasures in your life I will see you all in the next video. Bye, loves.